Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I am Milan Garcon and thank you all for being here. I'm really excited to bring you all today's video. It's a highly anticipated video. You all have been asking for it on all of my social medias and I have been neglecting you. It is gonna be a makeup tutorial, I know. Today's video, we're gonna do a 10 minute soft glam. I do this face every day, like after I get to work, don't tell them. For those that do and don't know, I get to work at 3 a.m. in the morning. I work on a morning show. So my schedule is pretty hectic. I wake up around one. 1, 1 30 and I'm on my way to Manhattan by 1 45 1 50 at the latest so you can probably see why I don't wake up early enough to do my makeup at home but I still like to look you know a little cute and fresh by the time the rest of the work world wakes up and I'm out and about and I don't look like I've been up since one in the morning this is literally like my go-to sometimes I can get this done on my desk let's get into it all right y'all so I'm back at you bare face believe it or not the trick about this makeup technique that I'm gonna show you all is more product, less cream. We're really only gonna use two cream products, which is a concealer, a foundation, the rest is gonna be powder. Those of you that are afraid of powder, I'm gonna help you not be afraid of powder. Setting spray is your best friend. Long lasting, long lasting, long lasting. Everything else, we're gonna zoom through. I'm gonna do my best to show you the products. Everybody get ready, get set, go. So we've started, okay? You can see that. I'm gonna, maybe I can find a way to like start a timer on the thing. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go in with some primer. This is a Black Radiance Radiant Primer. <laughs> this is gonna be funny me trying to say all of this stuff fast. So I know I just rubbed, but this is in the name of Russian. I'm doing it in the name of Russian. You don't need a lot of anything. If you have super oily skin, still, you don't need a lot of anything. Um, I know it probably sound like I was going to say something really important. Bobbi Brown Concealer. Keep everything we're using close to skin tone. This is not super, super, super light. I will show you why. We're going to go in. And I'm not using that much, as you can see. We just want to barely cover. So we want to highlight the high points. If you don't like a feature, do not highlight it. Again, do not highlight it. Or if you just like snatching a feature. Do not highlight it. So my chin area is like one of my least favorite parts of my face. So I do not highlight that. I don't want to bring that to you. I want to hide that from you. We're at eight minutes and 56 seconds. I'm going to shut up. So I'm going to take my beauty blender. And I'm just going to blend that out. The full coverage concealer because you don't want to have to go in with orange color corrector or whatever color corrector is your favorite. You don't want to have to do that. I literally do this so fast. If like, if you have the terrible habit of always doing it like me, you just take the excess and put it down there. Don't worry about it not looking enough. Don't worry about feeling like you can still see a little bit. I feel like I can still see a little bit. I'm a little worried. But just a little tap here. Just a little tap there. Nothing too crazy. Okay. We're almost to the eight minute mark. I promise y'all, it gets real sexy real fast. I'm gonna go with my Bobbi Brown foundation. It does not have to be the same foundation at all. I'm going to use the back of my beauty blender only because I might wanna go back in and tap in the top. So I'm gonna take it and just put it in a few different spots. That was one more squirt. And you just want to, like literally you wanna move fast. I mean, clearly this is for like, if you don't have a lot of time, it's all gonna come together, I promise. Blend it up into there. Now take it, redo that. We're not gonna waste any time. We're moving right on to setting powder. I'm using my Sasha Buttercup setting. We're gonna press it in and we shouldn't really have to dust anything off. This is why I say don't worry about it not looking too full coverage. You are going to steal the deal, I promise you. Okay, we press that in. We're at seven minutes now. Go in, do a light one on my forehead. Now next, we want to grab our full face powder. I'm using MAC NW46. Of course, this makes sense, right? Does it make sense to everybody? I hope this makes sense to everybody. Use something that's close to your skin tone. This also doubles as a powder foundation. So, you're getting more coverage with this. That's why you don't have to go crazy with the cream. If you're real bold like me, you can just use this. We're at six minutes and 30 seconds. I'm trying to tell y'all how fast 10 minutes really is. Cause sometimes you do just need to get out the house and sometimes you will cancel your plans if you feel like you can't get out the house. That is now done. Now I'm gonna go on with my 
Do I have any more of this in here? Yes. I'm going to go on with my Black Radiance Concealer Palette. I have the same palette here, but it clearly, you see, I use these a lot. So we're going to use one color from one palette, another color from another palette. All right. Very lightly. I'm just going to go right in the corner and see what I'm doing. And I'm not telling y'all to see what I'm doing. I'm asking myself, like, girl, do you see what you're doing? Okay, you see how that's there? Boom, we got that. That other shade is going to come into handy. Use what's on the brush. Don't keep adding. I'm going to do my forehead because, honey, we have a leave out and not a, not a lace front. So the forehead is definitely showing this in. So we're going to do that. I told y'all this is my area that I don't like the most. So this is the area that I refuse to compromise with but now um go back in here okay we're done with that color we're done with that color now i'm going to take a different brush something a little bit bigger and fluffier i'm gonna take this middle shade from here and now i'm gonna kind of just go over everything and just try to marry all of these colors together the best i can the quickest i can we're at five minutes and we already have our base done um yeah so cute trick i'm about to show you and try to like try to know where your products are too like i'm really i'm really just winging this because i really want to show you all so i'm gonna go in with max hard to get blush it's a beautiful blush and it already has a shimmer in it so we don't have to like worry Ooh, what was that we don't have to like worry about too much so you see how that just brings all of that together right there. Let's bring this in. Let me not get too off center. Four minutes and 27 seconds. So you can kind of have fun with this. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to take this brush. I'm not putting any powder on it, but this is the same brush that I use for the MAC Press Powder. You can see the color again. And you'll understand why I'm doing that. Mm-hmm. Now, because I feel like being a little spicy, I'm going to take this brush, I'm going to press it, and I'm going to cut the cheeks since I am trying to show you all a little something. And I'll still go back in. Now, we're going to go in with our highlight color. We are 3 minutes and 51 seconds. I'm going to go ahead and highlight the bridge of that nose because sometimes I will forget to do my nose. Then I'll be mad because I really love snatching my nose. There we go. All right. And for the rest of this, I will use a fan brush. None of these brushes are spotless. Hit them cheeks. It's so funny. I'm literally just a little bit on the chin. It's a habit. I, I, I can't knock it all the time. People always talk about how much they like my bronzer. What they really like are my cheekbones. But, you know, I'm not going to be picky. All right. I'm going with this fluffy brush. I'm going with that middle powder. We're at three minutes. With that middle powder very lightly. Then I'm just going to do my best to chisel. Oh, wrong side. And then once we get down to about a minute 45, I'm going to go ahead and prep my lashes. Right now we're at 2 minutes and 45 seconds. So y'all see how that nose just came together like that? Sides, nostrils, tip, button. Bring it into the brow, call it a day. All right, now we are going to focus on our eyes. I'm going to take my brush. I'm going to brush these up. All right, let's see if we can do these brows. Now, normally I won't put anything on my brows, but just for the sake of the game, that we're, I mean, it's not, this is not a game. See, it's not fucking funny. But I'll just do just a light fill. Thankfully, I already have fuller brows. If if you don't, I would maybe give yourself just a few more minutes to get your brows on or to tell whoever is waiting on you that you're not going to be ready in time. Okay. We got something on there, right? There's something. Okay, we're at a minute 40. We have to hurry. So... I'm gonna pull out my handy dandy this, my handy dandy that. We have lashes right here that I just took off of that thing. So we're gonna use these. 
So another trick is multitasking. I'm gonna glue these lashes while I put mascara on and throw just like a little shimmer on my eye. Oh y'all, I really hope I can do it. I only have a minute and 13 seconds left. So my last 15 seconds or 20 seconds is going to have to be putting these lashes on. Okay, I'm gonna go in with this palette here. I'm gonna take me a brush. I am literally gonna go in with the lightest shade that I have. Transition shade, put it all over my eye. Bring it into that corner, blend that. We're at 45 seconds. Do the other side. You really don't have to do that much in the eye because your eyes are going to stand out and look beautiful and gorgeous because we're not doing a, a dragged out wing liner today. I'm gonna take a little of that chocolate brown, throw it in the corner, very blendable, drag it out just to give me that little wing tip effect. 28 seconds. Boom, boom, boom. Mascara. Get you a good liner. We're at. All right. Five seconds, y'all. Five seconds. And I'm throwing on the lashes and we're basically done. Oh, girl, it's glue on the thing. Oh, we're a minute over. Baby girl, these lashes are flat boots. That's the problem. You know, normally my lashes look way better than this, but I probably shouldn't use the, the lashes that have been stuck on top of. Okay, girl. Okay, girl. We got it. I probably shouldn't be using the lashes that have been stuck on top of a skincare product for like over a month. But let's just say a bitch had to work today and I'm a little tired. I'm motherfucking tired. Probably do something y'all have never seen anybody do. I'm gonna curl some falsies <laughs> real quick. Now don't, you do not have to do this. I'm being so extra right now, but it's only cause these lashes are like super flat. So I am gonna gently curl these falsies just to give you a bit of the effect that it's supposed to have and if i didn't have the problem with the lashes we would have <laughs> i keep throwing this away if i didn't have the issue with the lashes we would have done our lip In this case, we are not trying to draw a new lip. We are just following our natural lip line. Chestnut by MAC. Every girl needs it. It doesn't matter your skin tone. If you like a little bottom lash, it can also give you like a little liner effect too. I like to smudge mine against the, like against my eye. This brush, we're gonna clean that little part up. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> no, I'm not going to give you easy breezy beautiful cover girl. But she is. This is a very easy breezy beautiful cover girl look. And boom, we're back into it. Now, it did take me 13 minutes, but I think that that's I think that that's really good seeing that this is a soft glam look. This is not like just a little foundation and concealer situation. We actually are getting the J-O-B done throughout the day. This could be for work. This could be for the club. If you're a setting spray girly, e.l.f. Long Lasting works amazing. It's a soft mist. You could do your thing. My hair is probably going to poof up. That's the same as water and humidity, but you know what? Anything for the channel, right? But guys, we did it. We're here. We made it. We made it to the function. You told your girls you was going to be ready in an hour. And now you probably will be sitting there like, where you at, girl? Or you could surprise the girls and be like, I'll be there on time. If you all want me to do a more in-depth video where I actually like give a fuck, then let me know. And I can do that for you all too. Subscribe, like, comment, do all of them things. Run the coin up. Like support the girls. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate you all. And